What's up guys, we're back with another video. This is one that I didn't expect to be doing, but I got some crazy news today. A lot of you guys have seen it and some of you guys haven't, but PSA has shut down every service level that's lower than Super Express, which is $300 a card. So you can't send regular, you can't even send Express level anymore until they said their goal is to return by July 1st. That's over three months three months that they're basically shutting down unless you already have your cards there. So you can't send them anything else. This is bad. This is bad for me because I just got that huge collection and I didn't submit any of the cards yet because I, I didn't expect this to happen. So I figure a lot of you guys are in the same boat. You have a ton of cards you're about to submit or you've been waiting to submit. This is why you don't wait. This is why you don't wait for it to calm down because it shut down. PSA basically is shut down unless you're going to spend $300 on a card, which is only worth it if you know, it's a huge card, but if it's anything under like a $10,000 card, you're probably not going to send it in. I mean, that's just a ton of money. Wow. That is, sh it's literally shocking. I'm so, I'm so shocked. Like it's not like a month. It's not too much. It's three over three months that their goal is to return after three months. Like they didn't even say for sure that they're coming back July 1st. Their goal is to come back. If you want to grade a card, you can't go to PSA. You now have BGS. That's your option. You can go to BGS, but they're already just as backed up as PSA was. And now they're going to be getting a ton of submissions because nobody can sit, submit to PSA. They're like, oh, well, CGC, they don't grade Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So yeah, guys, Yu-Gi-Oh is straight out of luck right now. We have BGS. That's it. CGC will not grade our cards. PSA won't grade anything unless you want to spend $300. So if you're trying to grade something for Yu-Gi-Oh, you're basically out of luck unless it's B you're going to send a BGS and just wait for two years. So that's pretty much your options right now. It's crazy. I mean, it let's let's be real. Let's this is the same thing we said when they doubled in prices. When they doubled in prices, I was like, okay, whatever. People are going to keep sub submitting. And clearly they did because they just decided to shut everything down. But it's not the end of the world. You don't have to grade your cards. You don't have to, you know, get them encapsulated. You don't have to do it unless unless you need to flip or something, which is never a good idea that you need to flip your cards as soon as you grade them because then you're relying on the, the grading company to even get them back to even grade the cards, I've obviously. This is just some crazy news. So if you guys have not heard this, I mean, I wanted to let you guys know, this is insane. So if you're planning on submitting to PSA, uh, you're gonna have to wait. And also, I am i don't know what's gonna happen with like the middleman companies, but assuming they definitely have to shut down now because they can't submit anymore. So it's gonna be a huge pain for them because they're gonna have all these cards they're supposed to be submitting. And now there's not an option to submit them anymore. I don't know if they may have, maybe have an agreement with PSA or something, but that's just crazy. So this is just a shorter video, basically letting you guys know PSA has shut down and now we can't grade our cards unless we send a BGS. So this is pretty big news for the trading card collectible community. I mean, I, I don't remember news like this big. This is pretty big because when it comes to the whole grading aspect, PSA is like 90% of the market and they are deciding to completely shut down. Now you're down to your companies. People don't use it all. And then there's, you know, BGS and then CGC if you're a Pokemon fan or a Magic fan, but they don't grade Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm guessing that CGC will start grading Yu-Gi-Oh during this. That's that's my guess. And if they do, we're probably going to send some cards to them just because, I mean, where else are we going to send them? So let me know what you guys think. Do, oh, like, so let me know what you guys think about this. Did you Were you about to submit some cards? Do you have um, cards at PSA currently? And what do you think about the whole shutdown thing? What do you think is going to happen? Just let me know in the comments because this is a weird situation. This has never happened. PSA had like never changed their prices until recently. And they had, oh, I guess they had shut down and turned COVID for like a week and everyone freaked out. And now it's for 12, 13, 14 weeks or whatever, like at least. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about this. It's crazy. And that's, that's pretty much it. We will be live tonight or whenever you guys are seeing this on Wednesday, we'll be live. 6 p.m. Central, opening the Duelist Genesis. So make sure you guys go check that out. And that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Oh. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright. Boom! Oh.